in this question we need to find the acceleration of 2 kg mass okay so if you look at the system uh, there are four there is uh, 4 kg mass and there are two pulleys and string is connected so based on the mass we can consider that 4 kg is going to uh, move downward like with some acceleration a okay and uh, the tension in the string let's consider as t so here tension t is acting and here also tension t will act and in this direction tension t will act so these are the tensions because it's the same string so throughout the string the tension should remain same so everywhere t will act now uh, let's try to draw the free body diagram of this 4 kg 4 kg so two tensions are acting here t here t and acceleration due to gravity will act that is gravitational force that we will write it as mass times acceleration so your mass is 4 acceleration is g 4g along with this acceleration is downward so with this we can write an equation that is uh, like 4g minus 2t because like 4g is downward 2t uh, is upward so we have to subtract which is equal to mass times acceleration so this is like uh, uh, newton's law sum of force equal to ma f equal to ma so here sum of force i have written 4g minus 2t which is equal to ma m is 4 here m into a fine now uh, let's consider this 4 kg is moving downward by x distance okay if it has to move x distance then this pulley has to move x distance which means the strings both the side of the strings has to move x distance okay so if both the side has to move x distance then here 2x distance of this mass should have moved so this one you have to visualize carefully to understand why it has to move 2x distance so since altogether the pulley has to move which means uh, both the side we need the x distance displacement that's why overall this displacement is becoming 2x the same thing we can use it for acceleration so here the acceleration of this 2 kg mass is going to be twice of this 4 kg that is 2a fine and when we consider the forces acting on this 2 kg we will have here mg of course normal force will be there but we can take the component of the same g here this will be mg cos 30 degree and this side is going to be mg sine 30 degree so the normal force and this mg cos 30 will get cancelled and we left with the horizontal forces so that will do it as a free body diagram so 2 kg uh, it is in a slanted way i am just considering in a horizontal direction so this is mg or uh, ms2 so 2g sin 30 degree and in this direction tension and the mass is going to move with acceleration 2a along the tension direction so we can write it as t minus here sin 30 is 1 by 2 so this will become g so t minus g which is equal to twice of 2a so t minus g equal to 4a let it be equation 2 and this is equation 1 from this we need to find the acceleration a okay so we can multiply the equation 2 with 2 and then add with equation 1 so 2 into 2 we'll get uh, 2t minus 2g equal to 80 let it be 3 so if we add them then the tension will get cancelled and we'll get 2g equal to 12a so the a will become g by 6 but what we need we need acceleration of 2 kg and it is 2a okay so the 2a equal to 2 into g by 6 which is g by 3 so the acceleration of 2 kg is g by 3 